hello everyone welcome back to power distribution channel uh, in this very bright day I am going to do a insulation test or hypo test or commonly called meager test on a three-phase distribution transformer in this process I'm going to use a very versatile equipment called a high voltage insulation tester before we use this instrument it is very important to check the battery condition move the selector into the battery check position and then press to start and see whether the needle still pointing at the good battery indicator battery is good this is the line terminal the guard and the earth terminal then we put this align probe into the appropriate terminal and then the earth probe into the earth terminal before we do an insulation test on this transformer it is very important to check the wiring or the factor of this particular terminal as you can see this transformer have a Y Y connection so in this particular case all the three primary terminal plus the neutral will act as a short circuit the same condition also applies to the secondary windings uh, which is all the three terminal plus neutral will act as a short circuit in order to check the insulation level or condition of this primary bushing or the primary windings we connect the line or the red probe of this measuring device into any of the primary uh, terminal and then we connect the earth probe or the green wire into the ground connection of the transformer on the right for standard for minimum insulation resistance value according to the voltage level applies to this particular transformer in our case the system voltage is around 11.7 kV so the minimum insulation resistance should be around uh, 5 giga ohms the same treatment applies to the secondary windings in order to measure the insulation level uh, we connect the line or hot probe into any of these uh, secondary terminal and then the earth terminal to the ground connection of the transformer the minimum insulation resistance value uh, we seek is around 25 million ohms for this particular transformer last but not least uh, we measure the high voltage to low voltage uh, insulation resistance uh, by connecting the line or hot uh, probe into the primary or the secondary and the earth probe to the secondary or the primary uh, or you can do it otherwise it doesn't matter i'm gonna use this brand new transformer to demonstrate the process and show you the perfect insulation condition of a transformer first we will measure the resistance between the primary bushing or terminal against the ground or the tank by connecting the earth or the green rope into the ground set the instrument to 5000 volt and press start then touch the terminal carefully measure it for around one minute and read the resistance the resistance is around 50 giga ohms from the needle which is very good for this transformer next the secondary windings touch the terminal slowly and read the measurement and last but not least measure the resistance between the primary and secondary the reading is around 60 to 70 giga ohm which is pretty good so the insulation resistance of the transformer is very good next we will measure the insulation resistance of old transformer it's actually a dead transformer measure the name plates show a factor diagram of YY connection we connect the earth terminal to the ground connection press test and probe the primary bushing carefully 
and immediately show a zero reading for the face A then some reading on face B zero reading on face C for the secondary terminal wizard also a zero reading for all the terminal now for the sake of our demonstration we will also measure the resistance between the primary and the secondary uh, endings as you can see immediately it show a zero some reading on the face b indicates some breakdowns on the winding conductor to put things in the perspective about this uh, dead transformer we know from our measurement that all the primary and the secondary pushing show a zero reading except for the phase b uh, show a some reading which mean probably inside the transformer there are some a breakdown on uh, windings conductor causing to causing the phase b terminal to float and show some reading there you have it guys the installation test process of this three-phase transformer if you enjoy the video don't forget to subscribe and give us like for more content and video in the future thank you very much for watching this video